and they enjoy from where the Warwick Council. I'm going to start trying to do regular blogs to let you know what the Labour group are planning to do if we're successful in taking the council in May, which looks really hopeful. This weekend, as you can see, I'm in the most beautiful setting. I'm actually over in the Isle of Wight at the moment. And I'm staying in an eco farm, which is fantastic. My boys are absolutely loving it. And they're just running around and playing and enjoying. And it's got me thinking about Worthing and about how we are really fortunate to have the South Downs to the north of us and the sea to the south. But actually, we spend a lot of our time in the town and that we really need to green our own town. It's so good for our mental health and our physical well being to live surrounded by beautiful countryside and actually live in beautiful countryside. It's perfectly possible to um, not have Worthing as a concrete town, but as a green town in a place that can really see wildlife coming into our streets and where we can plant trees and where we can have a town centre that's got green buildings. So this has really inspired me this weekend to go back to Worthing and to work with our team to make sure that um, when we come into office in May that we have some really good plans to green the street where you live and the town centre where you want to go and do your shopping, take your family to enjoy a day out and when you walk along the seafront and you look at our Worthing town you think wow fantastic place to live and it's really good for me my health and my family's health so i hope you all have a great weekend if you get a chance to come across the isle of wight it's brilliant but hopefully worthing it might not look quite like this but i think we can do an awful lot to make it a green and fantastic town nice to talk to you talk to you again soon bye bye